Hello again, Steve here with a few words that I just thought of to do with what I'm going to call protecting ourselves from the good stuff. Does that make any sense? Not really, eh? First blush, it certainly doesn't. But, if we think about it, think of water, for example. Water, we're made up 70 to 80% of our body. I think I could be wrong on that, but it's a, it's a high percentage anyways. Of our body is constituted with wa is water, right? And we need to drink water fairly regularly. Some of us love to get in the water and swim, enjoy it, walk in the rain. However, water can be extremely damaging. How much people put flood insurance on their houses, on their basements, on their vehicles, their cars, their boats. Maybe not a boat, but I guess it's uh, uh, insurance against sinking. Just watched a video about the... Uh, the, f the potential fraud of the Titanic, the insurance fraud that went on, that was to do with sinking in water. So water, it can do a lot of damage. And yet it is so valuable. But, um, and it's just, just a, a metaphor really, but I was talking to somebody recently, a young guy who likes to play video games. And he was telling me about a friend of his who he met, who also likes video games, but has a discipline to realize that they have a place and a time. Because sort of like too much of the good stuff almost creates like a mind rot. Right? Not getting anything done, anything other than just playing the video games. So that's kind of like um, too much of the good stuff. Right? And um, so the protection then is to be, to be somehow disciplined, to realize, okay, it's okay here, just like the water is perfectly fine in our body at a certain constitution, we're thirsty, we've got to drink it. But too much of it, I mean, walk out in the rain for a while without the proper rain gear, my goodness. Um, all of a sudden, we don't like the good stuff. But if we're properly protected from the rain, it can be quite enjoyable. Um, I was working on a job today and part of it was to put a clay <clears throat> slope all the way around a big building. And the purpose being that when it rains, that it flows away from the building <clears throat> and doesn't hang around the edges and compromise the foundation and make a mess of the, the you know, make mud, mud puddles and muck everywhere. So as long as the water runs, it doesn't go into the ground very much. If there's enough slope, it just shoots away into the ditches and is not a problem so you know but it's great when it rains it's good for the grass it's good for the all the forms of life that need water but too much of it in one place and all of a sudden you get stuck in a in a mud hole right so that's just uh something obvious of course but we can relate it to ourselves in so many ways there's so many things that we enjoy but as soon as we get too much of it, all of a sudden it can be damaging. And, you know, there's an old saying, you know, everything in moderation, or everything in balance. The question is, where is that equilibrium, right? Where is that ideal? But we kind of know that often, right? We know that sun is a beautiful thing to feel, but if we're out in it too long, all of a sudden we feel groggy and sunburned. And therefore, we have to protect ourselves from that good stuff by having some shelter, sunscreen, if it works. I'm a little skeptical of it, but certainly shelter is great and uh, shade, you know, um, awnings from the rain, you know, weather protection, and also protection from others in a way, you know, as much as we may enjoy going out and having a few drinks with people, well, it's easy to see that we can overdo it quite quickly too and then the next day we feel like like shits right maybe the shits for sure but also we feel shitty so just a few thoughts on that for whatever it's worth I think it's important to realize that pretty much all the good stuff in our lives has its limit and we need to find ways to be able to 
divert ourselves on wheel, on on command in a way that, okay, now that video game's enough. Okay, now that drink is enough. Okay, now that food, I just ate that plate. I'm satiated. Yes, that half of a quarter of a cheesecake looks good. However, there's such a thing as too much of the good stuff. And in fact, it may not be the good stuff, but it sure tastes good. Um, a lot of this stuff is just very obvious, right? But I like to, I like to talk to myself and while I'm at it, talk in front of a camera for, what, for whatever it's worth. It's great chatting again, though, and we'll hope to, hope to do this again soon. Bye-bye for now.